If you're an Amazon seller that likes to run rebate campaigns as a way of launching new products, getting reviews, and ranking faster, then you're gonna wanna keep watching this video because I'm about to share with you the best re rebate campaign that I've created that is going to build multiple assets for you. It's going to warm up your audience, get full priced customers as well as rebate customers and overall maximize every dollar that you spend in ad spend. So let's go ahead and jump into it. So before we jump into it, just wanna let you know, my name is Ian Smith and I run a company called EvolveMedia.Agency. We're an Amazon marketing agency and we work with a ton of different Amazon sellers to help them rank higher, increase order volume, get more reviews, all that kind of stuff as a way to grow their Amazon business, own more customer data, and get more sales off of Amazon, like in their Shopify store and different places like that. So if you want to get a flow like this built out for your Amazon business, feel free to book a free strategy call with me by going to www.evolvemedia.agency. Up in the nav bar, there's a done for you services tab. You can go and you can look through all of our different uh, services that we offer and you can book a call on that website. So now let's go ahead and jump into this flow and really what it all comes down to is a giveaway campaign and then after doing running a big giveaway campaign, then you hit them with the offer of joining the rebate program. Now, the reason why I've seen this work so well is because you're warming them up first with the giveaway campaign and they're not being sketched out at all because usually rebate campaigns, they raise a little bit of red flags. They're like, okay, why are you doing this? Um, why are you just gonna give me this product? What is in it for you? How are you, it, it just, it sets, it starts the relationship with a little bit of a weird tone. So that's why I like to run giveaway campaigns as a way to open that door, start that relationship on a more natural tone, a more uh, realistic way of saying, hey, enter our giveaway, enter to win, and then, um, hey, would you like to join our rebate program in the process? So let me go ahead and quickly go over the, re the giveaway flow and then the rebate flow. Um, so first we start the Facebook ads. We start with Facebook ads. We link it with the JSON growth tool here in ManyChat. So this is what this is showing you right here is the actual JSON. Now at first it just says, ready to enter the $500 ultimate foodie giveaway. Now I would recommend giving a big prize away so that it actually is incentivizing for people that make substantial money. If, if somebody's making over $100,000, they're not gonna wanna enter to win a $50 product. You gotta make it worth their time. So. This is the JSON flow. They're gonna see the Facebook ad. They're gonna click on that. They're gonna be sent this message right here. And then the next process is gonna be all inside Messenger. Now, one thing to know about the Facebook ads is we're, we usually see cost per entrance around 20 to 40 cents, usually within that high 20, 30 cent per person range. So it is very low. You know, if you spend a thousand dollars, you'll get roughly 3000 people to enter your giveaway. So it definitely works pretty well. And as you'll see, we're building multiple assets. For example, we're building our Facebook custom audiences. We're building our messenger bot subscriber list. We're getting their email through the entry process. Then we're giving them a uh, coupon code and we're getting them into a Facebook group. So I'll explain the order of things, uh, but here is the JSON. And as you can see, it's just a confirmational message just saying, hey, do you wanna enter this giveaway? They say yes. It then opens the giveaway flow right here. And let me just go ahead and edit it and, and jump down lower. So after they click on yes and it says, great, the grand prize is valued at XYZ. Um, can you give us the best email to reach you at for when we choose the winner? So you want to make it like sound like it's mandatory for them to give you the email. That, like that's how you're going to reach them. Obviously, it's not necessarily mandatory because you can always reach them through a mini chat messenger blast, which I'll show you how to actually message them outside of a 24-hour window. So you say, great, let's get your email. You tag them as a giveaway entrant. If they say, no, I don't wanna give you my email, then um, you know they'll, they'll say, no worries. Okay, here's an additional, a way to get an additional entry. I don't wanna go to, over this too much in detail because I've already made a bunch of videos about this. So just general, basically you get their email address. Then you're saying, hey, would you like to get an additional entry by liking and sharing the Facebook post? They say yes or no if they wanna do that. And then if they say yes, you hit them with this message right here, perfect. Click the button below to like and share and you're gonna link that over to an actual post. Then you're gonna say, by the way, uh, if you wanna actually join our Facebook group because that's where we're gonna announce the winner, click the button below to join our Facebook group. 
And then most importantly, you need to hit them with an OTN type of message. That's a one-time notification, allowing you to hit them outside of the 24-hour window. So now it's gonna say, get notified, you know, tap, notify me to allow us to message you when we pick the winner. And I also plug this a little bit here in this last message saying, lastly, please tap the notify me button below so that we can reach you when we're actually picking the winner. Um, so kind of wording it in a way so that it's like, look, in order for us to let you know if you won, you do wanna click that button. So you wanna make it as incentivizing as possible because this is gonna allow us to actually hit them a week or two down the line when we have a winner. And that's usually the time frame that I would recommend is doing about two or three weeks max during this giveaway. Um, so after they go ahead and go through that process, then a 10 minute delay is going to start. After 10 minutes, they're gonna be sent a message just like this. Hey, we've got a rebate program. You know, Here's how it basically works. We get you to go buy a product and then we rebate you on the back end through an Amazon gift card or a Visa gift card. Please click the button below if you'd like to actually participate in this program. Right now with this giveaway campaign, we're getting about a 50% opt-in rate of the rebate program. So again, we're getting people for let's say 30 cents for an entrant in the giveaway, then 50% of them are actually joining the rebate program. So that gives us about, let's just say 60 cents cost per rebate entrant. And then we're, we're, we're debating, you know, this is up to you when you want to actually hit them with the rebate program. You can definitely hit them while they're still inside the giveaway campaign, you know, inside that two week window. You can then say a couple days later, hit them and say, hey, um, do you want to go ahead and, and participate in our rebate? You know, we've got this product to offer you. Let's go ahead and get you to participate in that. So it's up to you if you want to do it inside or outside. I personally would recommend hitting them outside of the giveaway window, but you get them to basically opt in by saying get notified. So this is a separate OTN message. And then you do want to tag them as a rebate sign up. Once they're tagged as a rebate sign up, then you have that list. When you go into your audience section, you can then see all the people that have been tagged rebate sign up, and then you can go about either hitting them all at once and saying, hey, we've got our rebate option available, click here. But what I would recommend is dripping it out to them. So maybe let's say that you had a thousand people sign up for your rebate program sub-segmenting that into maybe multiple lists of 50. So then maybe you create, you know, 50 lists of 50. If that's how the math works out, maybe it's 20 lists of 50. I'm not good at math. But um, so you segment that down to just different lists of 20 and then you send out a message on different days. Let's say Monday, Wednesday, Friday, you send out a message to each of the segments and you say, hey, would you like to participate in our rebate program? They click on yes, then it links them over into the rebate flow, which I'm about to show you right now. But you don't want to send you know, a thousand people a message saying, hey, come on and join our rebate, because then when Amazon sees like a big volume spike in purchases, it's gonna look more fishy than natural, and you want this to look natural so that Amazon ranks your product and it actually helps you. Then after you actually get them through the rebate program and you, you get them to buy, then you wanna hit them and push them into a review funnel, a review message flow to try and get them to leave a review for you. So let me go now and show you the actual rebate flow really quick, because I don't want this video to be an hour long. All right, here is the rebate flow. Now, as you can see, if I just move it over to the right, it's a very extensive rebate flow. I mean, it's, it's big time. So um, this is definitely took a lot of time. This is given to me courtesy by Seller Tools. If you don't know about Seller Tools, I highly recommend them. Seller.tools if you wanna look them up. Basically, they will integrate with your Amazon your Amazon Seller Central account through the API, and then they will integrate with your ManyChat through the API, so you can automate the order verification process and also automate the payment process of the actual rebate, which is really cool. So they also give you this rebate ManyChat template, which is awesome, but in order to actually use this template properly and automate it, you have to actually have a seller tools account. I think you you need to have, you know, seller tools ranges anywhere from like 50 bucks to 100 bucks a month, but I highly recommend them. I use them for all of my clients, especially the rebate clients, but just real quick, I'll go through this. So basically, um, you want to also create your links, your keyword specific links, and I do use Pixel5 for that to create those links. So um, you hit them up, you say, hey, it's time to go through the rebate. We've got a product for you to 
to get a free rebate on. So um, a lot of these things are gonna be double checking in this rebate flow, like double checking that they're not on the blacklist, which means people that have taken advantage of the rebate, double checking that they haven't already gone through the rebate program for that specific product, double checking that they bought the right SKU, ASIN, sorry. Um, so if they, if they ordered from you in the past, but it was a different product of yours, and now you wanna have them order this product over here, product B, then they have an ASIN checker which will make sure that product B's ASIN was in their latest order, uh, the, the order ID that they actually gave you. So pretty cool stuff there. But basically it says, in the beginning part it says, uh, you know, let's get your order verified, um, let's get you to actually, so I think they link them over to, let's see, awesome, so they give you the terms, awesome, a few quick things. We will send you an email to choose your rebate, 100 plus gift cards, so that's the terms. Then they go ahead and gather their email address in this message, what email address should we send your card, your gift card to? We get that. Then the buy now button should be right here. So then it says you're approved to purchase. Click the button to go and get your product. And then uh, after about five minutes, they hit them with the, hey, did you go ahead and purchase? Can we go ahead and, uh, and, and we actually changed this. So I think it's like one minute or like something way short for that's standard with the seller tools template, but we have made some modifications, so we made it five minutes. So this is just a reminder email saying, hey, did you go ahead and, uh, and purchase that? Can we go ahead and process your rebate now? Then there is the order verification process where they give the order ID, it runs it through the API, goes to your Amazon Seller Central account, and then if everything looks good and the ASINs match, you know, the, the proper ASINs match, then it will go ahead and say, awesome. Uh, as soon as your order has shipped, we will send you your link. So this is assuming that it hasn't shipped yet, right? If it has shipped, and once the order status is shipped in Amazon, then this thing will automatically keep checking it, right? Then it says, your order has shipped, can we go ahead and grab your gift card? So now it says, um, let's see, so now we go ahead and get them through, I think there's an email, there's an email in here. This thing is so complex, it's pretty crazy. Again, if you want me and my team to build this out for you, uh, head over to www.evolvemedia.agency, book a free call with me, let's talk through your business, figure out what you're doing and what kind of products you're selling and figure out how we can go about getting this thing set up for you because it makes my head spin <laughs> even modifying this thing. Uh, fortunately, I didn't have to build the whole thing out, but this is a very complex flow. Um, so if there are issues, it's got fail safe messages for that. And then um, after they go ahead and get emailed their gift card, it says right here, okay, we've emailed your gift card um, to that email address. If you haven't received it within a few minutes, feel free to reach out to our customer service. And then there is this automatic email set up to link them over to leave a review. So that is pretty much it. I know it's a long video. If you're still with me, thank you for watching. Leave a thumbs up button below. Or, Click the thumbs up button, leave a comment below. If you have any questions at all, again, book a call with me at evolvemedia.agency. Would love to chat with you, love to see how we can figure out building out you a giveaway campaign and a rebate flow for your Amazon business. And I'll catch you in the next one.